The annual Race to the Sky sled dog race gets underway tomorrow in Lincoln, Montana. But as MTN's Jacob Pure reports, before the mushers head out on the trail, there's much to be done. By the end of this weekend, veterinarians will have examined well over 200 dogs to make sure they're in tip-top shape for the long journey ahead. They'll check their breathing, their legs, even their teeth, anything that might impact performance on the trail. Let's try to see if there's any um, any things that might pop up on the race that might make them run slower or challenge the musher or the rest of the team. Got the prettiest tail on our whole kennel. In all, three veterinarians and three technicians are needed to examine the dogs for the 21 teams competing this year, and there's 12 dogs on a team. It's a lot of work, but it's what helps allow mushers like Rick Katuki to continue to do what they love. This is Katuki's first time trying the race to the sky. Oh, it's been going on a long time, has a good reputation. Got a good bunch of mushers here, so I'm thinking it's going to be good. Race Secretary Pam Beckstrom has been working for the race ever since it started 33 years ago. Well, it started out as a 500-mile race, and it was the first one basically in the West. Um, and so then it went to a 350, and it went to a 250, and a 500, and a 350, and a 500, and now it's to a 300, and it's it's really good trail now. Regardless of how long it is, Beckstrom gets excited for the race every year. It's just that excitement, that enthusiasm that the dogs have, and that just the teams coming together. And for some mushers, this is their Iditarod. They're never going to run the Iditarod, but this is their Iditarod. And sometimes it's harder to tell who's more excited, the mushers yeah, or the dogs. <laughs> If you watch the dogs, they are so happy and so excited. The musher has a really hard time containing them and keeping them waiting for their start time. It's a lot of fun to see that joy and, and excitement to do, do this. Jacob Fuhr, MTN News, Lincoln. Sometimes there's an issue of not enough snow. I don't right. think that's a problem this no. year. By the way, the race to the sky gets underway at 2 p.m. tomorrow. The winners are expected to finish sometime on Monday.